So the Brain Games episode on misconceptions, I think, could be a metaphor for the entire Brain Games series and for all notions of how we perceive reality. You know, we tend to take for granted our perceptions and what Brain Games makes clear time and again is that we actually only get limited information from the world and our brain is rendering an estimation, a guesstimation at any given time, creating this illusion that we call reality. And we're constantly having the rug pulled from underneath our feet when we unravel these misconceptions on brain games. One of the things that we look at and as examples of common misconceptions is the notion that we only use 10% of our brain. This is better seen as a metaphor that perhaps we don't utilize our brain to its full potential. But the truth of the matter is, the entirety of our brain is getting used. It's not like one little part is active and the rest is somehow dormant. We use all of our brain. Another common misconception is the notion of multitasking. We live in a multi-screen world. All these screens competing for your attention. An infinite amount of signals competing for that cognitive limited resource of your attention. Attention is the new oil. We live in the attention economy. And the idea that you can somehow multitask, you can actually lend your cognition to multiple things at once, is a fallacy. The only thing you can hope to do is switch rapidly between tasks. But the result ultimately is causing you even more fatigue and a feeling of being fragmented where you don't really know where to place your attention. The truth of the matter is it's always best to focus on one thing at once because that's the only thing you're cognitively able to do. Truly, truly, what we know about our brains uh, is often a realization that things that we've taken for granted for a very long time are nothing more than misconceptions.